Hi, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna make a white rice with the uh, mustard, so I can cue the ingredients. Okay, so for our ingredients, for the mustard rice, we're gonna need two cups of uh, white rice, <coughs> long grain. Also, we're gonna need uh, one tablespoon of uh, garlic and shallot mince, one of each. One cup of the fresh peas or frozen peas, whatever you have at home. And also, we're gonna need some uh, mustard you know your brand, whatever you want to use, it's going to be the yellow mustard and also we're going to need the whole grain mustard it's going to be one tablespoon of each that's for the, to give some color and flavor to the rice and also we're going to need some uh, oil, okay, about two tablespoons of oil so let me give you the next step okay, so we're going to need a pan with a little oil okay, and then we're going to start cooking our rice and since it's going to be white rice, we don't need uh, to um, cook it golden brown, okay? So we're just going to cook it barely for about two minutes or three. And then we're going to come back and add the rest of the ingredients. Now that your rice just barely changed color, we're going to add the shallots and the garlic, okay? <clears throat> and also we're going to season it too, with a little salt pepper to taste. Your choice of uh, pepper, you can use black or white, up to you. And then we're just gonna cook our garlic and our shallots for uh, one minute or so. And then we're gonna come back, add the uh, mustard and the chicken stock. It's gonna be three cups of water for each cup of uh, rice. So we got two cups of rice, six cups of uh, water or chicken stock, okay? So we're gonna come back and uh, finish our rice. We're gonna add the uh, mustard. Like I said before, it's like gonna be like two tablespoons. I put already one because I was doing the Spanish version and also on the whole grain I put a uh, one tablespoon so it's gonna be one teaspoon of a uh, grain monster okay and like I said before for the water so that way you have a perfect rice three to one three of uh, liquid water choice of a uh, you know chicken stock uh, bio stock anything so it's gonna be three for one cup of uh, rice so over here we have uh, two cups of rice, so sort of uh, six cups of uh, liquid or chicken stock. So we're going to put this chicken stock, okay, move it to the side so that way it doesn't start jumping. And we're going to cover it. <coughs> Let it cook for about 15 minutes. We're gonna add the rest of the water later because I'm gonna do the Spanish version. So, but you're gonna put the, everything, all the water together. And let it cook for 15 minutes. And then we come back and check our rice. Okay, so this is our rice after uh, 10 minutes. So what I did is just, you know, take the lid off. You're gonna see in the middle, still has some water. And I add a little bit more, okay? So it needs another five minutes to cook. Do not stir, do not move it around, just let it cook by itself. And we're gonna add a piece now, okay? Put them on top. Cover it. And then we're gonna come back in five minutes and finish our rice. Okay, so this is our final rice, you know, so you're just gonna move it to the side. See, it's clear, no water, it's uh, cooked. Now you're just gonna fluff it off like this with a spatula or fork. And this is ready to serve, okay? So just peel it to the side, put them in a container, in a, you know, a big bowl plate, or serve it however you like it. So hopefully you guys like this recipe. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel on our Chef, uh, Chef Alex Perez on YouTube and uh, Facebook. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you.